gets to stretches one calf raises we start with stretches four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve feet together let's start with knee rotations yeah one two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten nine eight seven six five four three two one yeah waist big ones one two three four five six seven big ones seven eight nine ten anti-clockwise when you do the waist rotation feet should be closed and then rotate one two three four five six seven eight nine ten yeah then bending front and back two four five go as back as possible yeah six seven eight nine ten yeah then uh side side twist yeah side bendings yes one two three four five six seven eight nine ten cross ten Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Wonderful. That is your cross. Now twist again. Put your feet together. Twist. Twist the other side. Twist. Nice. Keep twisting. One. Two, three, four, five, oh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Yeah, that was. Stretches, shoulder, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Clockwork, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Anti clockwork, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. This completes all the stretches. And now, body brain gyms, two of them. Let's begin. Elbow and knee, let's start. Yes, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, then hands and feet. Yeah. To the front, to the back. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, so that completes body breathing. Seven uh, now, seven exercises of hand. And let's start arm rotation one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and equal points. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. That is arm rotation. 
then uh, arm swing, sorry, this is arm rotation. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, then nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah, that was arm rotation, arm swing, shoulders. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Yeah, then uh, bell and pay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And the clockwise 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Change 1. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ninety one eighty. One, two, three, four, five. Open close. Five, four, three, two, one. Yes, change size. One, two, three. Four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. Then hand, nose, and ears. One, two, three, four, five. Italy and dosa. We have eight variants. Let's begin. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one, change. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one. Change sides now. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, two, one. Change action. One, two, three, four, five. Five, four, three, Two, one, yeah. Yes, now let's begin with fingers. Ashwarya, happy morning. Are you there? Ashwarya? Okay. Lovely. Ah, let's begin with fingers. Yeah, fingers. Uh, we will start with five and L. Finger gym, all finger exercises, five and L. Then two and three. Aishwarya? Aishwarya? Aishwarya, can you unmute? Yes, coach. This is Aishwarya. Uh, Aishwarya, late Aishwarya. Uh, Aishwarya, I'm putting you on spotlight. Finger we just started. Complete the fingers, okay? Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Tab got switched off, I guess. Okay. Start with fingers. I've completed rest. Mm -hmm. Okay. Start. Okay, let's start with finger bridge. Finger, five and L. Five and L is done. Two and three. Two and three. Yeah, two and three. Two and two. Gun and rabbit. Right. 
Taman Biki.
massage. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Just complete your finger branches. Let's start the eye exercises. Very twenty. I should have been actually take on. Oh, can I take on from here? Yes, yes, yes. The spotlight is on me. Yeah. If you change the spotlight, you can take over. Now we'll uh, start with ice. Ice when you be ready. Then um, uh, product one. Other hand. Next, from uh, order two. Next, um, Radu 3. Thank you. 
Chopra anti choppers now start of four the hand Um, other side. Now, um, sort of ice gun. Uh, next, next up and down. next um set stretches we'll have two round first round of when try to new and new could you Tarun, or my two son, you. Now, um, we'll do 
uh, stretches, two rounds, first round, run, start. Now, other side, uh, second round, three, two, one. Super brain yoga, super brain yoga, face east and the tongue on your palate, left hand right here, right hand right here. Start. Change the spotlight, right? Okay, uh, let's begin with butter at this thing. You have been signed out. Oh, I can sign in now. Ah, you can continue. Hey, is he my cut? Not yet. You can continue with this one. You can leave that. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Yes. Yes. Let's begin with butterflies. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Start. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight. Seven six five four three two one. Okay, air flaps. One two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten nine eight seven six five four three two one. Yeah. Here. Here massages. One. Uh, yes, we can feel the water. One two three four five six seven eight nine ten ten nine eight seven six five four. <laughs> Three, two, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, twenty, fourteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three,
Nice, squeezing it up and down, up and down, brain, ear massages. Yeah, now ear rotation. Clockwise, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Then up and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Alternative, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Front and back, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Yeah. Happy morning to everybody. Happy morning, coach. Happy morning, coach. Happy morning, coach. We had two days gap. Sorry for that. Uh, one day we had a technical reason. Yesterday when I came, there was so much of smoke. I realized that it might not be that healthy. It's much better today. Yeah. Let's get started. Yeah. Uh, today is about different stories about Diwali. Why do we celebrate Diwali? Different, different stories uh, from different parts of India and why we people, we celebrate Diwali. Some of you might some know some of the reasons. Yeah. One reason that we all know Diwali, why we celebrate is uh, Lord Rama coming back after 14 years of exile, defeating Ravana. That is basically the symbolism is what? What does it symbolize? Uh, good over evil. Yeah, victory of good over evil. Yeah, good always uh, prevails and bad always has to go. After 14 years, uh, Lord Rama coming back to Ayodhya. And uh, that's what they say, Diwali, Deepavali. Deepa, Deepa means uh, the lamp. There is this lamp. Bali means the line. So that Lord Rama can come back to Ayodhya they put a big row. They put a big row of uh, lamps. Deepa Vali. Vali means line and Deepa Vali. So that's how the people of Ayodhya greeted Lord Rama, Lord Sita, and uh, this thing, Goddesses Sita, and Lakshmana, all the three of them, when they came back. That was, this is one of the stories. Okay. Then, Pandavas. In Mahabharata also, the day Pandavas returned to Hastinapur, the people of Hastinapur, the entire city, had lit up lots and lots of lamps. That is also one of the reasons they say that, that uh, this thing, Mahabharata, also, they say that's how also it's called as Deepavali. Okay, one more, one more lesson and story is Narakasura. Okay, you know that story? Narakasura. Okay, Narakasura was obviously an evil, evil, uh, this thing, even Asura. Okay, a demon. Narakasura. Ah, Narakasura. He was there. Okay, this is celebrated in certain parts of South India. Okay, so what happened is Narakasura was very Narakasura was very powerful. He went to Lord Indra and took off his crown. Took off his crown, came back, came this thing, and uh, Indra realized this guy is very strong. I can't defeat him alone. So Lord Indra went to Lord Krishna. And Lord Krishna and Satyabhama both were sitting and he went, he went and said, this is what Narakasura has done. Uh, Lord, uh, please help me. So Lord Krishna and Satyabhama both go to start defeating, uh, to go and defeat Narakasura. That particular time, Lord Krishna realized Narakasura is very powerful. Very powerful. He cannot be defeated. He, can, he has got many Vardans. Many Vardans means... He has uh, got many blessings, uh, blessings. blessings. Yeah, he has got many uh, distinct powers. Well, the one power is he cannot be killed. He can only be killed by his own mother. He can be only killed by his own mother. The fight is going on and Lord Krishna is doing anything and everything, but nothing is working on. Okay. At that particular time, uh, this thing suddenly they realize Satyabhama. Satyabhama is uh, uh, Narakasura's mother. Okay, strange story. Huh? Narakasura and Satyabhama finally kills. Narakasura gets the, gets the crown back for 
Lord Indra and returns him back. That is also one uh, story. Again, what does the story symbolize? What good does over evil. again? Good over e evil. Yes, always good over evil. Yeah, victory always prevails. Good over evil. Good will always be there. In Sikh religion, in Sikh religion, um, Guru, one of the gurus, I think the fifth guru. Uh, the fifth guru celebrated his birthday on that particular day. I think Guru Haridas. Guru Haridas was the one who celebrated and he uh, said everybody to go to this thing, everybody uh, to light lamps on that particular day and pray the gurus. Okay, pray Guru Nanak and all the other things. So that is also one of the reasons why it is celebrated in Sikhism. In Sikh, Sikhs also light Deepa, the Deepaks everywhere. Uh, also on that same day, on Dipavali, uh, Dipavali is basically the 13th day. It is the 13th day of uh, one particular month. Kartika month. Yeah, Kartika month, 13th day. Uh, also, Golden Temples foundation was, uh, foundation was also placed. It's a very auspicious day in terms of Hindus. So, different, different things that happened. So, Golden Temple was also on, I think, Golden Temple, which year? 15, 1550? I have never not heard about Golden 15, something like the 15th century, 1565 or something, that particular time, Golden Temple, Temples uh, was, uh, construction had began that time. The foundation stone, the puja was done and they had started. So, six also celebrate because of this. What else? What are the other stories? There are Jains. Jains celebrate. Jains, for Jain, Jains, uh, it is not much of a celebration. They lose a guru, no? Yeah. One of the gurus uh, is, uh, you know, attains moksha on that particular thing. One of the... I could not say it is not. No, no, no. It is a celebration. It's a celebration. Moksha, it's not like they're losing. Ah. They have attained nirvana. Yeah, nirvana or something like that. The Jains celebrate uh, because of that part. Okay, then what else? Ah, there is also one more lesson or story. Uh, what happens is this, uh, this, uh, this one wealthy king, one very uh, king has only one son, and uh, he finds out that uh, this particular, uh, uh, this particular son is cursed. The day he marries, marries the next day he will die. In his, in his, uh, what is that? Jataka. What is that? Horoscope, it is mentioned. The day he will marry, the next day he will die. Okay, within 24 hours, and this thing will die. So finally, they get him married and get him married to a very wise girl. The wise girl, what she does is, uh, so, so Yamraj, uh, Yamraj comes to pick up this uh, man, the, the prince, the kid, the prince, the young prince. What does this lady do is, she leads the entire mahal. The entire uh, fort and every other thing, the palace with deepas keeps a very large deepa at the door. That deepa is called Yama Deepa. Okay, Yama Deepa is kept. So what happens is when Yamraj comes on his cow, his buffalo, uh, he is seeing so much of light, so much of light. He he finally uh, loses focus and leaves back, and that's how this lady manages to win life for her husband. Okay, so that's also one story. What does that symbolize? Good over evil. How is that good over no. evil? What? Smart always succeeds. Life over death. Life over death, yeah. Who was that? Diaz Amkach. Yeah. The wise what? always win. Yeah, wise always are smarter. Wise always win. Lovely, it is about buddhi over uh, buddhi always prevails. What are, the other, what are the other stories? Yeah. Uh, there is yam and yummy. What, there's yummy. one more story. Wa, yam and yummy, who was the children? Yam and yummy. Uh, that I'm not very sure. You need to check that up. So, yam and yummy, I think, were twins. They were the first few people on the planet. And Yam and Yami, 
who are twin brothers and sisters um uh, they loved each other a lot they cared each other aditi was their mother correct aditi was the mother aditi uh what happened was aditi was so strong that aditi aditi was not feeling the sun or something and uh, aditi was not feeling the sun she would not feel the sun she the however sun the powerful was aditi never felt sun and never cre- ha aditi never created a shadow aditi never created it's a very vague story okay i have not uh, read that heard that story or heard that read the story in a very long time and uh, for some reason something happens and yum and yummy they get separated yum yum dies yum dies yeah yum dies yum is the first person to die on the planet and that time it was that kind of a time where it was not human beings so this person dies and becomes a god yum dies becomes a god and on bhai doj today is bhai doj right today is bhai doj yeah on bhai doj uh one day after diwali that is one day yum comes down after two days one or two days later uh yum comes down from the heaven to meet his sister yummy yummy is still around i believe and they tie that string in their hand he is still around so yum and yummy story so okay coach yummy is still around ha ah. I said that. wonderful story. So, what is the what is the symbol? Uh, what how what does this story symbolizes? Yeah, the big story. You can't se- separate siblings. Yeah, brothers and the love for brothers and sisters are also very very pious, and it cannot be separated. Ah, this is one of the key reasons why Diwali should be celebrated. It is it has become very commercialized. and it's become more of purchase getting things and you know uh, ha this is something which is even happened and it is a misconception and this is not the right reason why diwali is taken place dhanteras what does dhanteras mean dhanteras anybody knows what is dhanteras no dhan is money right dhanteras is what heroes spending on giving ah uh, they it is become like a uh, this thing that we have to buy gold people go into a lot of pressure that you have to buy gold on that day it is very auspicious so a lot of business happens around gold on this dhanteras dhanteras i have i believe happens one day before but actually it is not dhanteras this is god is two days before two days before no yeah so dhanteras is actually uh, it's, it's more of commercial which has happened in the last i am not sure 50 100 years or something like that i don't have much of a data on that but the real reason is dhanvantri it is not dhanteras it is dhanvantri who is dhanvantri dhanvantri is goddess goddess of health god god of medicine yeah god of medicine she is the one she uh, this thing she incorporated she wrote ayurveda yeah she is the goddess of this thing and why do we celebrate it it's the 13th day of kartika masa winter is coming in and winter we need to take special protection and though in chennai we don't feel much but all over other parts of india it becomes really cold people have to change their lifestyle people have to change their food people have to change lot of things uh, from don't become sedentary because it's cold don't sleep too long all the other things so dhanvantri is the it's dhanvantri's birthday i think 13th day and that is the time we have to pay special attention change the way we eat way we sleep the way we drink and all the other things so dhanvantri became dhanteras <laughs> dhanvantri became dhanteras and we will have forgotten actually diwali is one of the reasons is that we have to take care of our health it's about taking care of the health but the amount of sugar people eat the amount of food and all the thing happens is actually gone the other way around yeah and uh, due to fire crackers a lot of uh, people that hurt or animals yeah smoke and animals have a lot of difficult time so that's all commercialization of a festival happens okay that is basically the business world ah talking about business world business world celebrates diwali 
thinking, uh, saying that it is the new year and that's the day they start their books, they start their businesses saying that it is a new year for their businesses. So, so many reasons, so many reasons for celebrating Diwali. Yeah, there are another, I think, another one or two more reasons, are sure. I'm not very sure about that. Light over darkness. Light over darkness. Ah, light, is, the light is put so that uh, darkness is... Hey, when Ram was from me, he, they could not see the path, so that's why they lifted the earth. So mm. that's the path. Yeah. Uh, so one of the major reasons why we should celebrate Diwali is one is take good care of your health. That is very, very important. And also, uh, it is victory over evil. Good always prevails. Lovely. So, all of you enjoyed the stories. Let's... Does a bird have more, like, more, it can hear more than us or more amplified? Yeah. Yes. Like so, dogs. Yeah. They can hear ultrasonic. Because uh, I, when I was there, no, in, uh, uh, for puja, some neighbors had, uh, you know, first uh, thousand, crack, the thousand one will come, no? What happened is there were like 10 birds sitting in a cage. Uh, the watchman likes to keep, uh, have some birds with uh, him. So there are 10 love birds there, huh? All of them burst like 3,000 crackers. Mm. I was like, oh, they didn't realize this. I so didn't burst is- crackers. So it is painful for animals, painful for this thing. It has become more uncommercialized rather than this thing. Uh, how crackers came, I'm not very sure. Okay, so we will get back to our this thing. First of all, I want to thank Ashwarya. Thank you, Ashwarya. Thank you, Yashme, for uh, taking care. And let's do the... Yes. Let. Yeah, there is one thing I want to let you guys know is that uh, today is what? 27th. Yeah, today is 26, 27. Tomorrow, superb study is starting. Yeah, for Secrets of Champion Man people, it is mandatory that you attend because 27th, 28th, 29th is your superb study. And 30th, 30th is the uh, final certification. Yeah, the goal setting session happens on that. So that is in our way. That is on Sunday. So plan for it. Yeah. That's it. That's yeah. Dog was just crossing. And I was trying to just cross. Ah. Let's see if I can. Yes, let's begin. Let's sit in Vajrasana. Yes, yeah. Hmm. Close your eyes and keep it closed till the very end. Alternate nasal breathing. Relax, relax, relax. Be breathing. Six of them. Hum. 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 Cut 
tell you to keep your eyes closed. We are starting with Energizer. Let's do a round of 30. Relax, 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 lock your arms. Let's begin with gratitude. Thank yourself. Thank yourself that you celebrate Diwali for the right reasons. You celebrate Diwali to ensure that you have a great health. And also, yes, it's a victory of evil. You work on yourself, putting out all the negativity from yourself, from like anger, hatred, jealousy. All these things are negative that we always work upon. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank all the external part. All the internal part. Thank those two lovely souls, your dad and mom, for giving you the amazing values. Thank you. Thank all our gurus, teachers, mentors, trainers, all of them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for imbibing such great values within us. Thank you, family members. Asta Tej, I'm so blessed to have you both in my life. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank all the people we know, everybody, all the superb humans, everybody, the entire humanity. Thank you, Mother Nature. Mother Nature, you are so amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank, thank God, thank Almighty, thank Supreme Soul for giving us this wonderful, amazing soul, a soul with a purpose, soul with a why. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now that we've completed our gratitude, it's time to visualize a beam of white light that's starting in the universe just for us as it enters our head, enters our face, our throat, our shoulders, our chest, our abdomen, our pelvic, our thighs, our calf muscles, and to head to toe, we're filled with wonderful energy, enthusiasm. Every single cell is now revitalized. All the toxins are leaving our body. Visualize that. Yes. Visualize how complete happiness, all the negativity, all the negative thoughts are getting converted into positives. And this white light will stay with us for the next 24 hours. Help us, guide us, motivate us, push us towards our purpose, our goal. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Now, slowly... Uh, now that we have done our gratitude, our visualization, hands on our heart, I am a champion. I am a champion. I'm lovable. I'm lovable. I'm, care I'm healthy. I'm healthy. Wealthy. I'm wealthy. Smart. I'm smart. Wise. I'm wise. Intelligent. I'm intelligent. I am a genius. I am a genius. I'm smart. I'm smart. I'm happy. I'm so happy. I am enlightened. I'm enlightened. I'm spiritual. I'm spiritual. I'm lovable. I'm lovable. I'm capable. I'm capable. I am a superb human. I am a superb human. One, two, three, four, five, go. Oh. This is a very important process. It heals our eyes. Last one. Slowly open your eyes. Thank yourself for being so disciplined and every day working towards your health. Thank you so much. Tomorrow, superb study starts. Remember that. And it's all the study techniques. We have not done any studies related in Secrets of Champion Mind. It happens on these three days. Yeah. Six hours, 5.55 p.m. Yes. And um, on 30th, remember, we have our final workshop. Uh, it's a certification, yes. Thank you so much. You're lovable, capable, you're the best. Thank you, Ashwarya, once again. Thank you, Yashmit, you guys are the best. Thank you, everybody.